I went crystal shopping and I just thought it would be kind of fun to show you guys everything I got. I love watching shopping hauls in general. I don't think I've ever watched a crystal one, but I feel like it's something I would love to watch and I love crystal shopping and I love talking about what I got. So this might be kind of an often thing that I start doing. So I didn't go crazy today, but I got a few different things. Um, I got this pendant and this is green aventurine. And can you see how it's like cut? It's so beautiful. Green Adventuring is so good for prosperity and good luck. It's like the good luck stone. Green Adventuring is something that is constantly kind of recommended for money and prosperity and things like that. Good luck. Um, they say if you go to like a casino or even if you go to play bingo, like take Green Adventuring with you. It's supposed to be very lucky. And I just think it's a good stone to have around if you're looking for new opportunities. I am going to lay a little bit of sage. I do want to clean these, um, kind of like as I'm getting them out, I just want to put them through some smudge. This is actually black sage and all different types of sages do the cleansing thing, but additionally different types of sage help you with different things. Um, and they all smell a little bit differently. A lot of it is like preference for what you like smelling but also you can look into like the different properties of the different sages and I'm just really hoping I don't turn my smoke alarm on. So I'm gonna keep this over here. Okay, so first, I love calcite. All different colors are cool. I found a couple huge chunks of orange calcite that I just couldn't not get. Let me smudge this really quick. And I'm simply letting the smoke kind of cover the surface of the crystal. So all calcites are very cleansing and then the additional colors give you kind of like additional layers of properties. And the orange calcite is very, like to me, it just screams happiness. It's a very, very happy, joyous stone. And I love them. I have, I have like a few pieces, but they are maybe like a third of this size. These are just really massive and beautiful. And I got two of them because I couldn't decide. So here's my other one. Aren't they happy? So I got these two big orange calcites. <sighs> they feel so nice and they're so heavy. Um, I like keeping large pieces like this outside in my like meditation hut area. <sighs> I don't know where I'm gonna keep these. I like them so much. I might keep one on my desk actually. Okay, next I got a couple of pieces of raw moss agate. It's been kind of like on my to-do list to get more moss agate lately, but in my head I thought I was going to get some tumbled ones. I really, really like these though. Oh, the color is so nice. And they feel even better right after I smudge them. So I got a couple of these. Um, thinking back on it, I probably should have gotten four so I could put them in a grid. I'll have to go back. I also got a piece of raw green opal. I don't have any green opal. I don't know a lot about it. I'm gonna look into it a little bit more, but I just, it's actually the first thing I saw and picked up. It was just really calling to me. And the color is just so nice. Green opal's a really beautiful color. So I got that and I got a couple pieces of, most people probably know this as selenite. A lot of what is in crystal shops people call selenite, but it's actually technically called satin spar. Um, satin spar and selenite are very similar. Real selenite 
you can kind of like see through it. It doesn't have the milkiness in it as much. Um, it's almost like clear glass or clear quartz. Um, you can still like see things in it, but it's much more clear. Whereas Satin Spar is the one that you see most of the time. That's like more of a solid white kind of. So these are much clearer than a lot of the Satin Spar selenites that I have. Um, so I feel like this is higher quality. You can like see through it. <laughs> and I got two of them. I didn't realize until right now that I got two of almost everything. So I got two, 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 and then I got two random green stones. Interesting. I didn't go in expecting to really buy anything except for Sujolite. I'm looking, I am on the hunt for the perfect piece of Sujolite for me. I know it's the next crystal I'm supposed to get. <laughs> it's like the the next one that's like calling to me a lot like moldavite called to me and i'm really like pumped about it i'm really excited about it but i know it has to be the right piece um that's actually what i went looking for today they didn't have any i really don't want to buy any online but i'm just i'm open i'm waiting for the right piece to come into my vortex and then i will get it and i will work with it until then i will continue collecting crystals because i can't help myself so that was my crystal haul today, guys. I know it wasn't a ton of stuff, but I get excited about even a few crystals. And sometimes I do huge crystal hauls, so that would be really fun to record for you. I hope that you guys are having such a great week. I hope that you are following your destiny and taking control of your life and making all of the decisions that the, that the next best version of you would make because by making those decisions, that's how you become that person. So you always have to be thinking about that. Thanks so much for stopping by today, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you all have such a great day and I will see you next time.